This is part one of our Getting Started with Google Drive series, Upload and Store. With Google Drive, you can upload and store all of your files online. You can then share these files with your team and access them from any computer, smartphone, or tablet. There are three ways to get your files into Google Drive. In this video, we'll show you all three ways to get your files into Drive, showing you how to upload your files to Drive on the web, store your files using the desktop sync client, and upload files from your phone or tablet. So let's get started. One way to store files in Google Drive is to upload a copy of them using your web browser. To do this, go to drive.google.com. Click New and select File Upload or Folder Upload. And then choose the file or folder that you want to upload. Click OK or Open. You'll see the progress of the upload in the lower right corner. You'll want to keep this tab open until the upload is complete. Feel free to use Google Drive while it's uploading. The tab will stay there. I'm just going to sort our folders by last uploaded and just show you the progress as it is being up uploaded. Once all the files are complete, you can close the browser tab. If you're using the latest version of Chrome or Firefox, you can simply drag files directly from your computer to the Google Drive page on your browser. If you upload a file that matches the name of an existing file, Drive will add it as a new version instead of creating a duplicate. To see previous versions of a file, you can right-click on the file and select Manage Versions. From here, you can then select the file menu and either delete the version or restore it. If you like to open and work on files from your desktop and store them in Drive, install Google Drive for Mac and PC. This desktop sync client is convenient for storing large collections of files that would otherwise take a long time to upload. If you decide later to uninstall the client, your drive files won't be affected and can still be accessed from Drive on the web. To use the client, you install Drive on your computer, which creates a desktop folder named Google Drive. This folder works like any other folder on your computer, except that anything you put in it automatically syncs to the web and to any other devices with Drive installed. I've created another series that talks all about installing and configuring the Google Drive Sync utility. Check them out in the video description or the video info links. Once you've installed Drive on your computer, you can store files right from your desktop. Decide which files you want to store in Google Drive and organize the files and folders in the way that you want to see them appear in Google Drive. Move the files and folders into Drive folder on your computer. From now on, these files exist in the Drive folder and are synced with other devices that also have Drive installed. If your internet connection breaks or you need to go offline in the middle of a sync, Google Drive for Mac or PC picks up right where it left off when you're back online. You can also use the Drive app to store files on your Android or iOS device. If you decide later to uninstall the app, your Drive files won't be affected and you can still access them from Drive on the web. I'll quickly show you where to install the Google Drive app if you don't already have it on your mobile device. If you're using Android, you'll select the Play Store. If you're using iOS device, you'd look for the App Store and search for Google Drive. You're looking for the Drive app that's developed by Google LLC. Here I'm in my downloads folder. Uh, you can be in any other app 
but you can select any of your files and choose the share button. From here, you'll tap save to Google Drive. You'll also have options to change the folder in your My Drive. And when you're done, choose Select. Then Save. You'll see the status of the files. Uploading to Google Drive. In some cases, your settings might be set to only upload on Wi-Fi connections, so double check your settings.